remember the flowers, the colours, the scintillating, dazzling, rapid flow of flowers. Colours to our eyes that reminded us of times where it felt like our choices didn't matter. That we could eat from the earth like our silver platter. As if our actions could never leave the world in tatters, because convenience always mattered more. We had warnings, but we were cosy and comfortable, and didn't want to open that door. Because at least global warming will keep us warm, right? Some people did it right, but some remained mystified by the truth and believed it to be a myth they denied to their youth which would generate a cycle of ignorant generations. Worse off than the food chain starting with plastic in our oceans. Remember the sea? The clear blue water sea? The hexagonal streaks of light like honeycomb threaded through liquid topaz? And the trees? We used to have so many trees. Tall, strong oaks cloaked in robes of green, enabling us to breathe. And the air, it was clean back then. We could see further than a stone's throw, but because we chose to throw more than stones, we thought we were free of reaping consequences. But we were just postponing the payback of a loan that had a much higher interest rate than we ever cared to know. If I could travel back to then, in present tense, not way back when, Would I have thrown my plastic in the big black box? If I was able to turn back the clocks, would I have bought it in the first place? Would I invest in waste, knowing I couldn't erase the taste of toxic plastic pollutants and black air? Would I invest in waste, knowing the beautiful, magnificent gift of our earth, our home, our place came with one chance and can't be replaced? Remember the sea, I question, if I go back, what would I do differently?